Hello my friends and welcome back to my channel and welcome to this week's Sketch Sunday. And it is of course the third Sunday in the month, which means that we are playing along with Janet from, from Galaxy Girl Creations here on YouTube, her fun series Stretch the Sketch. And we all are playing along with 30 Days of Sketches. So today is day 17 of 30 Days of Sketches. And our sketch today is by Lisa Marie. And any information that I have, of course, will be down below, along with the playlist, uh, the Sketch Sunday crew, the Stretch the Sketch crew. Everything will be down below. Now, as you know, for Stretch the Sketch, the premise is that we either stretch or shrink the sketch. So you can make a, you can take a 12 by, we take a 12 by 12 sketch, which of course we have, and we create a project in a different format. So you can make it smaller, six by eight, eight by 12, six by 12, nine by 12, that kind of thing. You can stretch it into a double and my friends that is what I'm going to do today it's been a while well I, I did one last week for um my recipe challenge over in the spending freeze 2.0 group and I really enjoyed it so I thought you know what I am going to and this sketch to me lends itself to being stretched into a double page now you can also both shrink and stretch which is what I have tended to do fairly often, and that is a double page six by eight. But today, let's have a look. So, I have white cardstock, I think, for my backgrounds, and I'm playing, I'm playing with um, the Mercy Tiara Celebrate kit. Uh, was that the December kit? I think it was the December kit. So. Uh, I'm going to stretch this out here and let's see whether is all of this in frame for you. Yes, it is. All right. So my idea here, I have four photos. I'm going to use one photo for the left hand side and this is going to go into Erica's album and then three photos, I think, on the right hand side and these are photos uh, from uh, a trip down to New York that she did just before uh, between Christmas and New Year's. Erica's boyfriend lives in New York so when she gets a chance she does take a little bit of time and goes down of course and then he came back for New Year's. You're going to see another layout uh, about that. So that is the first idea that I have. Now I look at the layering. This is a fun layout that's got a lot of layering and I picked this gorgeous green from it's got this lovely lovely stripe on the background as well and I don't know I might use this little bit we'll, we'll have to see because at the moment I have that on the side because I've cut this gorgeous green which also um, happens to be Erica's favorite color as sort of the backdrop now I'm thinking to get this the way I want it I'm going to have to move the whole left hand side over a little bit. I think that is the idea that I have. I would do something like this for the back layers. Now I went into my stash and I got this Bella Boulevard Besties uh, paper. I've taken a little bit off of it here at Guacamole and I think I'm going to map my photos with that. Uh, also from my stash, and I think this is a Stampin' Up paper, I've got this gorgeous sort of peachy corally because I've got this pattern paper from the Celebrate kit. And this is a Chamel pattern paper that brings in this gorgeous green and it has these peachy colors in as well. So I want to bring both of those papers in. And I think sort of my second layer will be here kind of thing. Try and do it a little bit because if you look, there's one large um, piece of pattern paper, then one on top. So I think I could bring this in and do exactly the same thing and then use this 
piece of paper to come over and out on both sides and that my photos in this lovely green. So that is the idea that I have so far. Now, as I said, I might, we'll just have to see, I might bring in uh, a little bit of this as well because the, definitely the colors match the Chamel paper. This is from April and Ivy. Um, there's some green and there, the navy from the floor. So we'll see. I might bring in a little bit of this. I haven't quite made up my mind. Or I could use my punches and have this as some of the embellishing. So we'll have to see. I've got these puppy stickers, which I think um, it are going to be fun. So we have Hippie Hooray. Um, let's see what I might use here. Not the congrats or anything there. Maybe, no, Sip Sip Hooray, I think I'm going to keep for the actual um, New Year's layout. So we'll have maybe Happy Day, but I think I can use uh, a couple maybe of these foam stickers. And then I have not used anything from the April and Ivy from the ephemera pack that came with the kit. And I'm thinking I might want to bring in some of the gold. So that I've brought that out. Puffy stickers, you know, I love, love, love using puffy stickers. And then I brought in, there is a sequin mix with this kit. But I brought in this one from Spiegel Mom Scraps from the March release. Because I wanted to bring in some of this fun purple, and then there's some iridescent sort of green, yellow, a little bit of the blue. So it matched, to me, it matched this portion of the kit a little bit more. So my friends, let me go off and get these papers cut down and get my basic uh, pattern paper set, and then we'll come back and finish this double page together. See you in a sec. Okay, my friends, so I cut all my papers down and I got the basis of, or the basics, I guess, of the layout down. So I'm going to keep these close. Now, so let's have a quick look. And you'll see in the end, I decided to go with only two photos on this on the right hand side. And being white cardstock, and of course you know me and my white cardstock, I needed to get a little bit more on there. So the first thing I did is, of course, get my get my paper sorted. So if you look at the sketch, I guess basically what I did is sort of take that design and put it in the middle of the two sides. So my background piece of paper here, then a smaller square as in the sketch. But then what I did, of course, is make this band much longer so that the photo on the left hand side is there pretty much the way it is in the sketch. And then I just bring this out along uh, even further out on the white cardstock here and got the two extra photos down. So I quite I quite like that. And um, I, I think you can definitely still see the sketch in it. Um, then I, so then I looked there and I said, okay, I need a little bit of mixed media, I think, on the background. So I went to get this lovely stencil. This is one of my favorites. And I got this, thanks, um, to an idea from my friend Ronnie. She was using it and then she let me know where she got it. So I was able to get my hands on this a couple of years ago. Uh, I haven't used it in a while, have I? So I'm glad I got it on this page. And I went with some bundled sage because I didn't want it to be too bright and sort of be too much in our face, but I did want a little bit of mixed media. So I've done this much so far. And then we'll see later on if I need a little bit more. So let's get this down. And I think it sort of goes a little bit like this. And I need to bring this up a little bit. So let's get this down. And I'm going to need to put a bit more adhesive, I think, on my layers. Because I just sort of tapped them down 
um, so that I could sort of get my stencil where I wanted it and get all those papers organized. So there we go. Let's put this side in first. There we go, because that is sort of what I want. And then I'll just align it over here. So yeah, let's get some more here and here. Here and definitely here. There we go. And a bit more there. Okay, I think that should be enough. And I'm going to need to put a little bit there because this was just sort of coming apart and I was fiddling away to get oops, to get it properly adhered down. So there we go. Okay, all right. Now, let's do the same thing on the other side. We'll get them properly lined up. So I'm just going to put this part out of frame a little bit to make sure I get this down the way I want it and sort of lined up over here the way I want it as well. Now, does that make sense? Yes, it does does. All right, so let's just bring this over. Okay, so there we go. All right, and then I will do the same thing here, get a little bit more of that down. Oops. And here. Here. There we go. All right. So now we have the basics of the layout and we've got a little bit of mixed media and let's see where we go from here. Now, I was keeping this out because if you look sort of at the top here, there's a little bit of an embellishment cluster that comes out here. I'm, I'm not really sure that I want to do that. Um, I have taken, this is from another kit. This is from another Mercy Tiara kit. And I've taken this out because I was wondering whether I might want to use this as part of my title. So hello NYC kind of, maybe get NYC in there. I also brought out the gold these gorgeous gold letters, but I find them maybe just a little too bright, so I'm not sure. Would I do hello over here or maybe here? Sort of hello NYC there. I think I definitely want to keep this. I don't think I'm going to use the gold, but I might use, because now you see, if we put this here, I could get NYC in there so that's a possibility let's definitely keep these out i also brought in a couple of bramble fox bit i have bits i have this fun say cheese don't know whether that would fit anywhere we'll have to see brought in good vibes because i think that is fun from the other kit and i brought a few um, flare here from Halo Magpie. You know, I love these watercolor cameras. Might bring that in as well. Put that there. And then, of course, we have these. Now, maybe something like Happy. That could be fun. Let me tear this so that I don't take it off. How about if I did something like that? Oh, that could be fun. Bring that up over there, maybe? Oh, I kind of like that. Now, there is a bit of a cluster there, but I'm not sure what else. I'm, I kind of like that. Okay, so let's leave that there. 
see. Is there anything else I would want? Oh, but then maybe if I have the hello there, that might be a little bit too much. What if I put the hello? Don't want it off there. Don't bring it there, maybe. Or would I bring the happy down? Oh, maybe there you go. Maybe bring it down here. And that makes... Okay, so let's maybe put it there. Let's go. Happy days. This little heart, maybe. Congrats. No. These little bits. I think I like the hello there. Now, because of the way I have the photos here, I might need to pop a little something in there. Now, let's see here if there is anything... That might be fun in here that, oh, now you see straight off the bat, oh, this is a little plant, because I was thinking this might be kind of cute, like right under here, would that be fun? I think it might. Okay, let's see where we're going. Okay, this, these, I don't think so. Let's see what else I might have there. Is there anything in here? These are a lot bigger. Okay, let's keep looking in here, my friends, and see what we might find. there's anything there. Let's see what we have here. All right, let's have a look at all these little birds. Oh, these are vellum. Okay, a lot of mo All right, so most of these at the top here are vellum. Would I like to maybe pop this? Happy together. She was with lovely friends but maybe ah now you see maybe something like this how about if we did something there and then we could put maybe a flare piece here that could be I don't know, I think it might be better if it was over under here. So let's see. Oh, there we go. Maybe with this. Oh, this I could bring over on this side, maybe. Let's put that there. And we put these up here. And I want this over on this side. Okay, so there we go. I think we might, I don't think I want the gold again a little bit too bright, I think. Okay, so let me put this on the side. I'm still thinking I might want to get this in here. Uh, okay, so I do want this, and we'll have to see whether I add something later or whether... Put this maybe here. This one further down. Something like that, maybe. I'm not sure. Okay, so the one thing I 
I'm jumping all over the place. The one thing I am sure of is I want this hello there. So let's put that there and let's do NYC in these small letters. I mean, she knows where she was, so it doesn't need to be that prevalent. So let's just pop that there. And I think with the colors, it shows quite well. So N Y C. So the title in the sketch, of course, is on the side, but I think I prefer it up here now that we've done a bit of a double page. So there we go. So we have that. Okay, now I let's bring this back out because I'm really not sure. And I definitely want to get this on here. really okay now do I want that here I think I I do I think I like it and I would bring it sort of over this way there we go okay I do like that so hello NYC I definitely like this so there we go now do I want to bring in I still feel I need something here. Let's see. Yeah, something like that. Do I want something like that there? Maybe that sort of bringing in bring this down even a little bit more. Would we do it like this? I find that just uh, comes out a little bit too much. Let's make sure here. So I want it maybe a little bit more up there. Yeah, I do like it. So that's, yeah, so that's sort of giving us a little bit of a diagonal. So I'm sort of, I guess, getting away from the sketch here a bit, but I think we can still, still see the sketch. And, you know, sketches can definitely be jumping off points as well. They don't, you know, they, they aren't necessarily meant to be followed to a T. They can be, you can take just elements from the sketch. And I'm sort of liking where this is going. Okay, so I do like that. Now, let's see over here. Do I want sort of the good vibes? I do like that, but then something needs to be under here. And maybe this is where we bring in the taps. Where did I put those now? Pop that, there we go. We have this one, there we go. Maybe bring in this floral, like right here, like that. needs to be over here more. I think I would like it a little bit more up there. Then bring this in and I would need another one, wouldn't I? Which then might be this one that we could bring like that. Okay, I think I'm sort of liking that. Bring this down a little bit more over here with that. I think I like that. And then we might bring 
cap. Let's do that. Okay. There we go. have something to put there we'll have to see what that is and it could be something like maybe this Let's bring this down here not sure Because I am, because I do like this, and I like the good vibes. Oh, that was not funny. The other one was so stuck, and this one is almost. Let's bring that in. There we go. And then maybe I could just pop this here. like that and something here or maybe a door with the bright side there although you know what I find this is a little too long let's see then if we bring in one of these fun but if we just brought in one of these there that could be good with the adore. Do I like that, my friends? Do I like that? I'm starting to dilly dally, aren't I? Okay, let's let's put the adore down because I do want that. All right. Definitely want that. Okay, so this side is looking pretty good to me. I need a little something there, and it might be a star or something. This, I find, it just sticks out a little bit too much. So I think this is doing pretty good. I think I do like that there. So we're going to put that there. Do I want to bring in, and I think I might just put another little something there. We have a little, oh, let's see, maybe the, maybe these puppy stickers. I think this could be the answer. Okay, so there we go. Now, oh, maybe I want the bright side here. That could work sort of here. No, I don't like that. But I do like that. I, I do like that. Okay, let's put that there. Okay. I do like that. So let's bring that over there. Okay. Now let's see if we can pop... this little butterfly right there and how about tiny little floral there we go I think because I like that it brings it down okay so there we go then let's pop that little floral there and maybe one of these butterflies up here. How about if we did that? That sort of finishes that off nicely. There we go. Then we come over here. So 
do want something. Let's maybe see if we have one of these little fellas. Okay, so am I bringing this bright side in? Let's see if I brought that. I would need a little something there that's maybe a little bit bigger. I think I like the bright side there, so let's pop, let's put it there. Okay. Jeez, I'm sorry this is going on a lot more than I thought, my friends, but there you go. Okay, let's pop that there. Okay. Then I think I do want... That these fellows up here. How about if I put him there? And then do I want maybe a little floral there? No. How about here? Yeah. That would fit nicely there. Okay, so hang on. I think I need to get a couple of little stars or something to put there. I'll be right back. Okay, my friend. So I went to get a couple. So let's get some Bramble Fox stars here, and I sort of like that there. There we go. And one. Let's get the proper colors. Let's see, this is sort of like a nice green. Oh, that could be nice. Pop that there. Or maybe more of that one up here. There we go. And then we have this nice navy one here and a tiny one right there. I think that might do it. Now, do I want to bring any over here? I don't think so. No, I don't think. We oh, maybe one up here. Okay, hang on. Let's get... Maybe one there, okay. And let's put one right there. Let me put this sort of turquoise. Oh no, we won't. We're gonna go in and get this lovely dark one. Okay, there we go. All right, my friends. So I think we, I think we've got it. Okay, so put that there. Then we have this little cutie pie. Pop him right there. There we go. And then this one right there. Okay, my, and this one over here. Let's take the backing off so you can see it. I'll just glue these down off screen because I think I've taken up enough of your time with my rambling and faffing. So I'll put that there. There we go. Okay, my friends, I think that's it. Now, the only other thing I think I am going to have to outline this. What do you guys think? I think this definitely needs outlining and I think I will do it in the darker green. So I'll put that photo um, at the end here, but there you go. So thank you so, so much for joining me. I'm sorry this was so long, but I really wanted to get the process on here with you. Um, and there you go. So as I mentioned before, Day 17, happy St. Patrick's Day, day 17 of 30 Days of Sketches Series 14, playlist down below, Sketch Sunday Crew down below, and Stretch the Sketch lineup down below as well. Thank you for being here, and I will see you back here very, very soon. Bye for now, friends.